Hey, cute people, it's me. I know I haven't been around that much this month, but I'm really going through it and just trying to work through some kinks in my life. And hopefully I'll be back on track real soon. But as always, I want to share something with you. You know, I'm sitting in front of a window, but I'm placed a whole nother way. So hopefully the light as I can see, the sunlight going in and coming out. Mmm really doesn't mess up these colors too much because I really, really want to show them to you. Nothing I'm showing you is very, very new. You've seen it before, but I just want to show it to you just in case someone else didn't see it. And these are things you have to see. As you know, Wet n Wild has come out with quite a few new things. I just want to show you some of the things that I picked up. But before I do that, I want to go to the beauty supply store. I picked up um, two pencils from um, Ruby Kisses lip pencils and I got plum and I have cocoa anything plum I'm going to pick up as you can see this is a retractable pencil and I was just playing it in a minute ago so I want to show you what it looks like now this is plum I'm not sure exactly what I was expecting, but I don't think that was it. Although it is a pretty color, these pencils only cost 99 cents, so I figured I'll take a chance. And you can never go wrong with a lip liner, right? And this one I'm going to show you now is called Coco. Coco is really pretty, just a really, really soft brown. There it is right there. I would like this all over my lips with some gloss. Mm -hmm. Just keeping it simple. Keeping it simple. 99 cent. Then I got three pencils from um, Nika K. This one is dark purple. Because I told you if it's purple, orchid, or anything like that, I'm on it. This is Nika K's pencil. Dark orchid. A dollar. The next one is called Purple Glitter. There's purple glitter. Now, on the end of the pencil, which you probably can't see, there's some glitter in this um, color here. But when I look at it on my hand, it's very, very faint. So if you're looking for a lip liner with a lot of glitter, I don't know if you would be or not. I really didn't care that it had glitter or not. I was really interested in the color. You can see it. If I hold it back here, I think you can see it a little bit better. But like I was saying, don't get it for the glitter. This one is burgundy. I don't know why they call this burgundy. Because to me, I'm sure, like to you, it doesn't look anything like burgundy. It looks pink. Let me make sure it says burgundy, does it? Yes, it does. Nika K, burgundy. And that is it right there. Looking nothing like burgundy. I don't get it, but... Now, remember I told you I love purple. So, on my lips right now, I have Max Smoked Purple. This I got from the Body Knees. It's just a sample. I wanted to try quite a few matte colors, but I was like, I just can't afford to spend 15 times, whatever. So, I got these, and I'm happy with them, and that's what's on my lips right now. No liner. Just dropped it on my lips. This is the last lipstick I purchased. This is another Nika K product. Black Orchard. Now, the color here is dark, you can see. But on my hand, there it is right there. Oh, if I come back this way, it looks okay. It doesn't look that dark, right? Looks like a nice, pretty burgundy color, but it's pretty, and I like it but looking at it in the tube it definitely looks purple but on my hand mm -mm, i don't see purple then i went to my favorite drugstore let me skip that because why it is my favorite drugstore i have to say but i was in manhattan so if you're looking for anything um from the collection of black radiance that's all new what i just said didn't make sense but it all come together black radiance has quite a few new products right okay so I didn't know that until I went into Dwayne Reed on 33rd Street and 8th Avenue in Manhattan. So if you live in the Bronx and you're looking for some new black radiance, go there because the right aid near me doesn't have it. And um, who knows when they're going to get it. Because here in the Bronx, I see they get everything late. 
everything. But anyway, so I only picked up two lipsticks because that's all I need to spend money on. This one is called Plum. The eyeshadows looks so pretty. These two color lipsticks here happen to be the most vibrant. They had other nudes and pinks and stuff, and I really wasn't interested. But this is Plum. This is what it looks like swatched right there. I don't know, it might be washed out because I see my hand looks so light and everything. And then on the other side of the dipstick, there's a gloss for you. Cute, right? I'm going to tell you the truth. I don't know how many days it's been since I picked these up, but I just, you hear me? I just realized that. Mm -hmm. Old lady brain. This one is fuchsia. Yeah, yeah. And that's what fuchsia looks like. Now, as you know, NYC has come out with some new lipsticks. I have, I believe, all of the stings they just came out with. I wanted to show those to you, but I decided to do what I call my favorite video, and that's swatching it for you. So, real quick, let me move through this. These are the two lipsticks that I have. I'm not even going to swatch them, but this one here is called Bury Me. And what I'm going to do when I do the video of the other colors, then I'll try these on also. Because the other ones are like 12 colors. There were 12 of these also, but these are the only ones that I really wanted. They had a red that I wanted too, but I didn't get it. And this one here is called, I think it says Blue Rose. And this is really, really pretty. Like I said, I'm sitting in front of the window and I don't want everything to be so washed down. Now, these I'm not going to go through too much. What I'll do the next couple of days, Wet n Wild, um, the Balm, Mega Slicks Balm Stains. I wanted to try these on, but I'm going to do it in a separate video. I promise, I promise, I promise. So I'm not really going to do much showing of them. I'm just going to show them to you like this. Go back. Okay, let me see if I can try to show you enough of... The packaging color so that you can see so I'm sorry for the fact that I'm not going to you know, do more showing in this because I don't want the video to be too extra extra long but I will promise to do a lip swatch a video within this week mm -hmm. also from wet and wild I got these um, eye palettes and lucky me even with the um lip stains I happened to walk into Rite Aid and they must have just put them up because I was able to get all of the mega stains whatever you may call them balm stains and I was able to get all of these also so I just want to show them to you and real quick I'll let you know that this one is called art in the streets Tunnel Vision. I'm his a breezy. And one thing that was great about these for me, I was able to use the coupon that came with all the um bomb stains and these um palettes too for a dollar off. So it was twelve pieces. I got twelve dollars off of whatever it was. And for me, this is floral values and the naked truth I'm really looking forward to trying these things um, because I have the rewards card and I'm at the highest level whatever it is so say if these were $3.99 with a dollar or some of them I got for like a dollar 49 cent because of the level that I am, I'm at I also picked up from Rite Aid this from um, Black Radiance. This is the um, True Complexion BB Cream with SPF 15. This color that I chose was Cafe. One thing I like about um, the display was that they have five colors and each color was a sample. And 
and it was still there because, again, they must have just put them out because I got right there, and I think one or two was missing, and they only have like two of each color. So I think this is going to be something in their permanent line, of course, because we know how popular BB creams are. And then I have this I got from Rite Aid. Oh, yeah, and it was also a dollar off on this product also. As a matter of fact, I don't think, no, they were, were they a dollar off on the, mm, I can't remember. But I got this too from Dwayne Reed. And as you can see, it's a True Complexion BB Cream and the Under Eye Concealer. I got this one before I purchased this one. And I saw someone's video, they hauled it too. And I was like, really? And I didn't get it for a dollar off, unfortunately. But for $4.99, it's not bad because this retails for $5.99. And like I told you, this color is called Cafe. This set here is light to medium see it much but they have the light to medium and then the medium to dark i don't know i had a um concealer with me that's my color so i got this one based on that the um medium to dark was a lot darker so i got this one here so hopefully it'll work for me if not but um let me see if they you you will not be able to see but they are slightly different in color. I believe this one looks a little darker. So that's my haul. Those are the things that I picked up. Man, how I wanted this to be a shorter video. But, you know, I wanted to share these things with you. And besides, you haven't seen me that much this month anyway. So you may as well sit through the whole video. I did tell you. I showed you. Mm -hmm, I told you what's on my lips. Yeah, mm -hmm, I did all that. So... That's going to be it for me right now. But I will do a video on the um, balm stain. So do stay tuned for it. They have my glasses broke on this side, so they may be all salted. But I thank you so much for stopping by and watching this video. Hopefully, I'll see you in the next. And I want you all to share and spread love. Hey, cute people. Subscribe to my channel and check out my last three videos if you missed them. Also, I'm on Twitter, Tumblr, and Instagram as Ebony Girl Speaks. Facebook, I'm Ebony Girl Speaks Naturally.